What's up, guys? Today, we're going back to our roots and we're doing a little bit of solo on some official vanilla rust. It's a little bit late at night getting a start, but that's cool for me. I want to build a cool base today. I want to build a base that's cozy and nice, but strong. And uh, there's a few groups we can mess with on the server. A couple shops I saw. So overall, should be pretty good. It's been a while since I played solo. So I'm probably pretty washed up. No lucky llama carries today. That's the promise to myself. And uh, it should be pretty fun, boys. All right. <laughs> I think we're going to get into it right away. Probably try and hit an early game oil. As far as I understand, both oils are down. So we're going to try and hit an early game oil. So that means we're going to need gun, cards, and materials. And then I'll be headed over there. Buckle up, ladies and gentlemen. Today is about to be good. I feel it. Oh, look at this beautiful view. So amazing. I've got to say, I don't think this game gets enough credit for like how good it looks. I think it looks great. I, I, it's kind of a based opinion, but okay. The cliffs, maybe not so much, but the game itself looks good. If my voice sounds a little weird, it's because I'm like still sick, but like just barely, you know, hopefully my health regens soon and, and uh, I stop being a little bit sick, but it'll probably like one or two more days and we'll be good. I don't know why, but I'm feeling a decayed based juicer find on this server today. Something about it, I just, I feel it in my bones. I feel like that decayed base juicer is going to hit us good. Oh, God. Okay. What the? There's a bot. Bruh. What? <laughs> what is this guy doing, dude? I just fought a real life Rust Navy SEAL. Dude, what is that gun? I mean, I, I kind of respect it. I've got to say, I did not expect. Dude, that guy was like checked out. I didn't, he didn't even shoot anything. Uh, free gun off the bat. Large furnace. Of signaling at something we make like a furnace base i definitely want to check out sulfur quarry i think that would be a good place to build just as a solo because then i could have my own like i have my own space you know so i vote that we just go take a look at sulfur quarry real quick probably after we hit bandit because i need to make some ammo for this p2 and then uh from there we'll just kind of figure out our options but I definitely want to make like a really cozy base. I could probably make something in the snow too. I'm just looking to switch it up. I haven't like, I never build in the snow. Usually I don't never even like build like an actual base, you know? Kind of just want to switch it up, do something fun and something like that. I have no BPs on this server though. That is kind of a problem. We made it. I'm just going to recycle here and uh, eat some food. And then I think we'll make our way up towards the sulfur quarry. I heard like a rocket. I was I was eating. I was munching, and I think this tower is getting raided. Dude, I was just trying to eat in peace, bro. I got like fucking seven bullets. Might be able to make a play though. Oh god. Wait, is that a sleeping guy or a dead guy? Can I build up here? That turret just snitched me out. No chance. What is this guy doing? What if he like crashes off the roof or something? All right, I need to try and see if I can build up like now. I think it's already a little late. Maybe I can shoot him out of the heli. Nope. That is unfortunate. Okay, I know this is kind of a pussy move. What if I get like a TC before them or something? All right, let's try and research pistol ammo. What about F1s maybe? I mean, I gotta get a, like a ladder or something. Out of stock. 
I'd say uh, it's not looking too good for my odds right now. Having some F1 grenades would be good though. I just, I gotta figure out a way to get up there, you know? I need them to leave again, probably. It doesn't seem like they're about to do that though. I think I'm gonna all in it, cause I don't really, I think the loot that I have on me isn't really that important compared to what I could get from this. He's M249 though. Like these guys are cheesing hard for sure. They're big cheesing. I'm just thinking maybe I could get a TC down before they can craft one or something. Like that would be pretty massive, but I don't know if I have time. Honestly, if I can even just get some scraps, that'll be pretty chill with me. But building up seemed kind of, kind of difficult. I might, I might be able to like boost myself up a level with that horse and, and honestly that could make a difference. But we'll see, the more time I'm not over there, the, the kind of worse off I am. I almost killed him out of the heli there, that was pretty close. I think I need to hit like a triple headshot if I want to kill him off the roof like that. I mean, P2's pretty bad. I'm gonna see if I can just do the TC play. The TC play could actually work. And it's turning nighttime, which is good for me. I just hope he's not looking my way. He's kind of looking my way. <laughs> Bruh, no way. What the fuck are you doing? Okay, I didn't kill him with that, did I? Head leg only gets him to 50 health. This gun sucks. I'm good though, I have TC access. I need to get health now though. I'm gonna just try and get back to Bandit, drone myself some tack gloves from Outpost, I think, and then come back. I think that's what we're gonna try and do. Hopefully I don't glow in the dark. I don't know if any of these skins do. He 2 is pretty bad. I think if I had like any other gun there, I might've killed him like that. God, I hate it. Stop shooting at me. Oh no. Okay, we're in safe zone, we're good. I have 15 scrap. Can I do anything in here with 15 scrap? Problem is the TC's like half wood. Didn't really plan well for that. I'm kind of hoping they just don't like notice it. That'd be kind of good, but something tells me they're not like that stupid, you know? I'm gonna need more wood to build up in any case. Nighttime is gonna be super helpful for me though. As long as they don't have night vision, which I don't think they do. But it's good because they, ca they can't put like doors now. They can't really do anything, at least for now. Like I said, I guess we'll see. I, I mean, I do have the nade. Like I could try and chuck up a nade. That could be a clutch play, but I don't know if I can actually throw a grenade that, that high. All right. What is this? 200 cloth? I'm going to try and steal their raid right from these guys. I mean, that would be so insane if I could make this play. But as far as I know, there's two of them, and they're both probably full metal. I think one has, like, an M2, and one has, uh, obviously an AK or something. It's a little bit rough. I feel like I could try and, like, bait one to look over at me. Because that AK guy is getting pretty aggressive with his peaks. Like, I might be able to bait him to look over the edge at me, kill him, have his AK fall down, and I build up or something. I just don't know how close or far away they live. Oh, he's trying to put a TC. Oh, it's so good that I connected that. See, they're gonna have to, like, jump off to break my TC, which kind of gives me a bit of an advantage, too. I don't think they quite realize what I did. Oh, my God. What gun does this guy have? Thompson? This is so stressful. See, I, I only killed him because he had a Thompson. I did. I just anything but this P2, man. Anything but this P2, and I'm good. Stop shooting! Stop! 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 The timer's gone. Okay, I'm hoping they think it like bugged or something. Now I have to find this gun, though. Finding guns in this game at night is like. Hey, hey, kids! Kid, there's a Tommy kid outside. There's a Tommy kid outside. Behind this box. Behind this box. You want me to drop Behind this box. Where is this Thompson? Oh, yes. Okay, I'm in the safe zone. Okay. Oh my god, that was stressful, bro. I need to, like, make a box or something. I wonder if that Thompson guy was his teammate or something. 
Okay, let me just put a box down. Just let me put it anywhere, please. All right, we're gonna put the P2 in here just because. Put some of the mats in here. Stuff I like that way. I don't really care if I. I don't really care if I die now. All right. That way, if we die, we're 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 good. I don't I don't think I'm really losing. I mean, I'm obviously losing stuff, but I think these guys are like. Oh, I really hope that Tommy guy just killed him. It kind of seems like he just might have actually done it. And I could just build up too, which is clutch. Although this Thompson guy is kind of a pain. I'm gonna have to kill him too. I, I don't really think I can trust him to like team up, you know? And it's turning daytime, which is a bit disadvantageous for me, but do I still have TC? Yes, I still have TC. I'm just gonna build up. <laughs> God, what am I doing? He did kill him. I'm, I feel like I'm gonna get rocketed though. I should just start clearing with grenades, eh? Um, hello? Why did bro just go AFK mid-raid? Now is not the time to be asking questions. But to answer any of your questions, yes, I have been paying my actors much more fairly recently. Hence why they just seem to go AFK in the middle of a raid. Okay, I think we're good. I need to seal. Give me just, give me like uh, a hammer. And a tier three. Dude, what? This is an insane counter raid. Like, I need to break my build up. Okay, we need to figure out how to seal this. I'm just gonna put two doors right here and here, and I think we'll be good. I'm worried they're gonna come back another mini though, so I gotta, I gotta go quick. I could also uh, start sealing this as well. This would probably be a bit of a better seal. Dude, that Tommy guy just, like, saved me for some reason. Now I'm a little worried about my TC placement, though. All right, what's the loot looking like, though? Any boom? Any boom yet? I mean, dude, I cannot complain. Like, are you kidding me? I can't complain. I am legally not allowed to complain here. This is, like, the most loot I've ever had. I've been on this server for less than an hour. Wait, why am I making code locks? Okay, bad habit, bad habit. It's all right. Oh my God. Yo. These guys are loaded, bro. I gotta go quick though. Just, like, what if they log on or something, right? I don't know what happened to the guy that was rocketing though. Like what, the Tommy guy like sprayed someone down obviously and they died, but like, where did they go? Cause they, I don't, unless maybe they just like ran. Like, that would probably be the most logical thing, I guess. But no, because the AK was on the floor, so... I think there's still actually, like, a dead geared guy on the roof. I'm worried they come back with more rockets, though. Maybe his body fell. That's what could have happened. Maybe the, the AK body fell off the roof, and the Thompson guy just, like, ditched with that because it was such good loot. That makes a lot more sense to me, I think. I don't really obviously want to live here, but we might have to, even temporarily. Uh, I also need to grief off the entrance so that the base owners can't come online. Let me get a bag in here. Dude, no way. I was literally just munching away, bro. I was eating. I was hungry. I was like, damn, dude. Trying to get some food. Sitting in Bandit Recycling. All of a sudden, here's some raids pop off and, uh... We just walk in there. That is the most peculiar thing. Like, why was that one guy just fully AFK? He had to have been, because I threw the nade. And he would have heard it. All right, let me seal in their front door. I don't know where this goes to as well. So I think we're fully sealed in now. Dude, oh my god, this loot. This is official vanilla rust and we're like an hour in, bro. 
This is crazy. Just like stole their raid out from under them. I don't even think I put on this guy's metal face mask because I was so confused. Where was this guy even AFK, bro? Right here. I mean, I guess I can just go jump down to where the turret is and, and uh, like unplug it before it kills me. This is the come up we needed tonight, boys. Oh my God. God, man. This wasn't the decaying base I was talking about earlier, but uh, I would argue even better. So it seems like they didn't have much in terms of boom that I'm seeing. But uh, again, I should reiterate that uh, I'm okay with that. I'm all right with that. I don't know what I'm going to do in terms of like where I want to base now, because this is a lot of loot to move. I do have the mini though, so there is that. I think the raiders just gave up. I say we just make a wire tool and go try and unplug that turret, walk off the front door, and then I think we're like all set. These guys kind of had a bunch of crud in their base. I don't know. They're crud collectors. I respect it, I do. But like some of this loot's kind of wacky. Like what's with the water pipe double barrel collection, you know? By the time I get a tier three workbench, like, you save the DBs for harassing clans, you know? That turret's definitely still wired. Oh no, it's not, we're good. I really, it makes me wonder what that Thompson guy really got away with, where he was like, I'm not gonna, no, no, I'm leaving. He must have gotten some rockets or something. Oh, we have a lot of instant ammo. Didn't I, didn't I bring a pump in here? We could just pump out the, uh, whatever it's called and we're good. We're safe. Now we're actually safe. How many AKs are we really pulling out of here? Two M2s? Okay. Not bad at all, if I may say so myself. That's like about a line to two, about a line and a half of like really good guns, all in the span of under an hour plus everything else like there's a lot of good stuff in here actually so i don't actually have a base of my own besides this one i guess yet sometimes rust is uh you know rust can be good to us sometimes other times not so much i'm gonna go fly around and go look i want to look specifically at sulfur quarry and maybe move there i want to move somewhere chill a little bit let's go take a look towards sulfur quarry See if there's uh, something there for us. I don't see anyone hanging around. I'm pretty sure that we have that base in the bag. I think that's us now. All right, so over here is Sulphur Quarry. You have a base with a car on it. That's usually not a good sign. That base is gonna be loaded though. Okay, it's walled in. No turrets though. Oh my God, it's running. Oh, there's a turret. Should I try and take the diesel? Is this stupid? Oh my. Oh. Dude, that is probably such a loaded quarry. It's not even funny. Dude, I gotta come back and try and break that turret. My second spot I was looking at building was somewhere over here. Maybe by this river. This is kind of like a cozy spot. Although recycling is gonna be a massive problem out here. But this is pretty cozy. Already a mini on this island. Does someone live here? It must be raiding that or something. Oh, oh my. Dude, this is their base, and they are also loaded. Oh my god, dude. Imagine if I had, like, four rockets or something. If I had four rockets. I might be able to kill him and go deep, though. Are you kidding me? Oh! 
Oh my... Dude, this is scripted. What? Dude. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm not gonna lie. I thought that was like filled with sulfur and stuff. I got debated, but still. What is this cloth? I don't wanna get blocked in here, so... I'm just gonna make some small boxes outside and uh, I'll just like put them in a bush or something. Something tells me that this isn't their like main base, I think. I, I think this is like their, I don't know what that is. I wanna say it's a farm base, but on second thought, I, I don't actually think it is because there's nowhere for them to grow this hemp. I'll just put the less important stuff in here. I feel kind of bad, dude. These guys are kind of dank. Kind of. They're pretty dank. I don't think I'm going to take all their stuff. Even just take, like, the sulfur and the cooked metal is fine. Don't really need the stone that much. I mean, I do kind of, but I think I'm just going to farm it instead. I think it'll be easier to farm. How unlucky for them that they were flying their heli at that exact moment, bruh. This is like the luckiest wipe ever. Oh yeah, we still gotta break into that quarry. I think I might have enough instant ammo to shoot it out. All right, I'm gonna go break that sulfur quarry. That sulfur quarry is gonna be loaded. I I'm, I'm talking like loaded, okay? This is crazy. This, this is an insane solo run so far. Probably one of my better ones. Oh my God, there was a hundred expo ammo in there. Wait, what? Dude, it just... Thing had like five health on oh my god oh my dude we got to get out of here we also got to find who owns this thing whoever owns this fucking thing is loaded what could i do with the hundred expo ammo that's enough for one door dude i say we do it i say we do it i'm pretty sure that's the way in this is loaded oh my god no way okay Oh my god oh my dude dude are you kidding me this has got to be like a troll i'm getting troll okay so it's a trio good to know i'm gonna do one run and just get out of here for now i think because like they don't have wood to seal anything there is just no way i don't understand let me just take these guns and put them in here so they can't Grab them. All right, I'm making a run. Bruh. Dude, I'm so lucky that there was 100 Expo ammo loaded in this M2 before I came to break the turret. It, this is unbelievable luck. I, I'm sorry. This is just insane. This is crazy. Oh my God. If I make it out with even just this, that's crazy. Bruh. I don't even have space for all of this. Please don't blow up. Okay. It's kind of rough landing on this roof at night, but uh, if that's the most of our problems, then we're doing pretty good. Please tell me there's some night visions in here. I, I know people never keep- oh my- I've just hit like the rust lottery today. Every good thing that could have happened so far is happening. I really should repair this heli, but I don't have time. I don't want them to blow back into that. I'm a little doubtful that they will, but they, they don't seem to be at their base or something because I blew up. I mean, I just raided that. They didn't show up. I blew. I broke their turret and shot. They didn't show up. I shot the python. They didn't show up and I emptied the diesel and they didn't show up. So it seems like they're like AFK or out or gone right now. It looks like we have to add a furnace base onto this list of things we need. Ooh, I see a torch in there. All right, we got to go. He's trapped in. GG. And now we go. That was a good play putting those doors on and taking those guns away. Very good play. I don't know if I, they're going to let me. They're probably going to camp in their gear and wait. 
Assuming they don't raid that, that kind of means I might have control of Sulphur Quarry now a little bit. Although I doubt it. I'm surely they'll raid that back. But I got two inventories of Sulphur out of that. That's like almost a near box of Sulphur. Like, we're chilling. I don't even think it'd be smart of me to go back. At least right now. I don't want to lose this mini, but probably crash it trying to land the thing. Uh, this is unbelievable. Th this is just crazy. I'm like two hours in, maybe, on the server. The luck has been unreal i don't get this i don't even have bps though that's kind of a big problem I, I gotta get like a rocket somehow and i don't think well who knows there's probably just gonna rockets gonna fall out of the sky at this rate dude dude all this loot thanks to like a 200 iq tc play I'm sorry, but I got to give it to myself for that one. Putting that TC down while these guys were raiding this base is like the best thing I could have done. Let's get a quick sulfur spread here from that singular roam. Oh my God, bro. Just shy of a box of sulfur. The cloth too. I totally forgot about Let's See if the cloth's even still there. Dude, I have two sleeping bags. They might've found the cloth stash. They didn't even find that. All right, I'm gonna just run this back to base for now, I think. God, dude, the fertilizer, that's so much scrap. We gotta figure out what the next steps are from here because we are insanely and utterly loaded, all right? Like, this is absurd. So I think the next step is gonna be try and get some boom BPs and maybe hit a raid. I, this is a bit crazy, but I'm thinking about those guys next to that sulfur quarry. They're online but they've got to be loaded with that much diesel and just running sulfur quarry and stuff like they've got to have some mad cheese and it's like a two by two honeycomb so i'm thinking maybe we smelt the sulfur and run up that potentially let's just look around we've got a lot of options that's a lot of sulfur we have so let's just look around viewer options for now i've got to smelt the sulfur uh and so we got to get some furnaces set up i went and recycled like every single component in this base and ended up with a nice chunk of scrap so i ended up with like 1200 scrap plus you know more so so far so good we might have to wait till the heli's out or something to get rocket but yeah whatever we could just get some more scrap and uh, so I think for now, we're just going to smelt up the boom and go scout out some places to raid, I think. I think that's going to be the move. I might just live out of this base. Is that stupid? That might be really dumb. Clearly, whoever tried raiding it the first time is going to try again. I, I'm just so lazy. I don't want to move. If we can raid that base by Sulphur Quarry, I'll move towards Sulphur Quarry. I think that's a fair deal. I'm hitting the tech tree. I think that's the smarter decision. I mean... Alright, I have 39 scrap left. I don't even know how much scrap that just used. But, we have rocket and boom BPs. So that's very good. Basically now, the only thing I need to do is just smelt, really. So, that's good news. I think a good idea is gonna be to run large oil. Because... I need to get more pipes, and also I want to get a refinery for low grade. Yeah, it's kind of a pain, but like, given that we've been playing for like a total of like two hours, this is still an insane wipe. I think we're still uh, on track for a really good wipe. We got all the BPs. That's like one of the harder parts. Now we just need to get pipes and smelt and charcoal. Charcoal is going to be hard, and then I guess craft, and, and we're good. Finding a decaying base with like a bunch of furnaces and charcoal in it would be a godsend. God. That base is loaded too.
Raid? This raid had to have been around here somewhere. I'm hoping we hear like one more rocket or something. Pretty hefty base, eh? They took over uh, high qual quarry. That is a good base location. I wonder if they were HV rocketing that. Like to break turrets or something? If that's the case, oh man. Maybe they're gonna try and raid that. That'd be an insanely profitable raid too. I, I feel like we're at the point where like, there's a lot of bases around here that are just a really, really good raid. Like we're not gonna go wrong with almost anything. I just don't hear anything. I hate it when this happens. Like someone's raiding and the next thing you know, you hear nothing. No. Hi. Oh, yeah. All right, I got way more excited than I probably should have for that. I thought those were real rockets for a minute, but I do think that that means that someone's looking, specifically that guy, is looking to raid this. And that's really good, dude. If that guy is gonna bring the rockets to raid this base, that's good, bro. Oh, that's great news. I wonder where he was headed to, though. I don't know. I think I'm, I don't know. It might be the base owner. I think I'm just confused. I see his rocket launcher sitting on top of the TC. Ah, oh, dude, I, I think I'm gonna go in. Hmm, okay, I see. I think he just looted a body in there. I'm gonna try and go in naked to start, and then retry geared if I have to. I'll just go in with what I have on me. I'm pretty sure he just looted like a stacked body. I saw the rocket launcher, but I didn't see that other body that was down there. Dude, what if there's just a bunch of real rockets? I doubt it, but I'm hoping there's a bunch of HVs or something. Oh. Oh my god, he's cheating. Uh, what? What a freak. Maybe I get him banned. What if he gets banned really quick? Dude, this is so corny. I think he thinks that I'm cheating after I killed him with the L9. Bruh, how do these guys like not get banned? I don't want to go on like a rant here, but we're going to do it anyways. How does EAC not recognize that this player has only hit headshots on me? Cheaters in this game just ruin the momentum so hard, bro. So hard. Oh my God. All right. You know what? Maybe it was meant to be. Oh my God. God, hopefully there's a bunch of rockets in here. Lord knows I deserve them after dealing with this shit. Ooh, his cheater just wants to talk. Why are all these guys so weird? I want to see what he wants to talk about, though. I wonder if he'll give me my shit back. Or what if he just uh, gets off the server and gives me a bunch of rockets? Or I'm hoping on a real note that this guy just logs off. Prison. What are you using? What a freak, bruh. Watched you fly, don't lie. I have more skins than your parents earn in a year on this account and lots of hours. Trust me, I don't cheat, bruh. Getting hackusated by a fucking hacker. What can earth do we live in? I watched you fly. That skin would got him good. That was a good jab. I have like you're fucking fuck lying. You're lying. You're lying. Bro, go to bed, bro. I have more hours in this game then, than then you and you all your there? friends, bro. Up where? If I was hacking, why wouldn't I just aim by you and get all my shit back? Like, hello? I didn't, I didn't take any of your shit. I'm just saying, like, why, why wouldn't I aim by you back? On, on a level one account? I'm not even level one account. It's just level I, one because it's have, private, you freak. I have two. You have two what? <laughs> that, that's not how it works. Uh, here, let me alt tab really quick. I have a level 28 account. I just checked. Mm -hmm. I just want you to know that you're wrong. I just, all I want you to know is that you're wrong and you're a freak. But I just want you to know that you're wrong and incorrect. I, I, how am I, how am I a freak? 
Because you're cheating in a fucking video game at 2 in the morning on a Tuesday. Don't you have better things to do, bruh? No, I, I, got, I got nothing better to do. Societally most productive cheater sitting in front of me. I just want you to know that you died to a legit player, that's all. It's just that, that headshot was crazy. You were standing still, dog. I don't know where you killed me from. I was covered from all angles, I swear. Yeah, well, your fucking cheats didn't fucking work, apparently. All right, well, I'll leave you alone. I'll Are you going to fucking hack on my dick or what? No, I'll, I'll leave you alone. All Anytime right. I see you, I'll leave you alone. Well, you know, I would appreciate that. Uh, and you know what? Even though I don't like you cheating and I don't respect it, I've got to say you're you're chill. And I hope you, you know, kind of come to terms a little bit and reform because you seem like nah, a nice kid. No. You will, bro. You will. Trust me. Well, you have fun, man. I'm gonna I'm go back to raiding that base. Peace. I mean, you know what? Honestly, that was a somewhat enjoyable conversation. Uh, depending on what the editor does or doesn't leave in. Basically, I just asked him how much he made selling cheats. He said he made five figures a month was his best month. So, you know, probably like $10,000 plus. But uh, I suspect it's not much more than 10000 10, But he said he made five figures in one month. And he's a 17 year old. That's pretty impressive for a 17 year old, man. I gotta, I gotta say, but I just told him, I was like, one day, like, you're gonna get sued by someone, you know, face punch or something. Someone's gonna fucking sue you. Yeah, that was weird because he didn't exactly seem like a bad kid. It's turning nighttime in Rust and uh i've made like no progress since we got the sulfur i mean i ran an oil rig i got some pipes i recycled that's really it i haven't really done anything my point being I, I mean the next step really is to just raid and it's getting late at night so i think i'm just gonna leave out of this base for the night even though it's a little bit risky and just wake up and pray that i don't get raided but we're definitely gonna we're definitely gonna run up a raid for sure we we gotta raid something tonight and, and i still have my eyes on that base by sulfur quarry i just i'm a little bit worried about charcoal i don't know how we're supposed to get charcoal maybe we just have to run a bunch of furnaces for a while try and just make the base look raided before i log out i think that's gonna be like the real move i think my heli's gonna get broken from this heli tick i hope the fucking cheater doesn't show up bruh oh god oh my god Well, uh, uh, my base is kind of broken, but suppose it could always be worse. I hope I don't get countered by the fucking aim botter. This is like the dumbest thing you could do. Like, you know a guy's cheating. You know he's not that far away or whatever. And you still take heli. You practically tell him where you live. So basically, I'm going on this kid's word that he's not going to fucking block with me. Not that it really matters, dude. I'm going to play the game how I always play and... If we get cheated on, we get cheated on. It is what it is. I will say, though, I'm actually having a lot of fun today. I don't... Maybe I could just take this thing over. Like, honestly, what if I just spent an hour jackhammering? I'd probably cost, like, a some thousands of scrap. I feel like that just is way easier than moving. And I won't have access to a few doors in the base, but I kind of like having this base on top of Bandit Camp. It's pretty convenient, actually. I'm kind of digging it. If that cave isn't taken, I'll make like a stash base. God. 2C43 rockets. M249. Okay. Where are the other crates though? Oh God. Okay, one more. 4X, kind of bad. Last crates, come on. 2C43 rockets. Ammo. We'll take it, we'll take it, we'll take it. Not too bad. The heli rockets actually kind of, kind of helped us a little bit. It's a good thing I broke through this, huh? Oh my god. Jeez. Interesting. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. I'm gonna check out the cave. I'm gonna assume it might be already taken, but you know what? I guess we never know. Maybe. Just maybe. 
We can make a bunker in here. If we can make a bunker in this base, I'll be way more confident that it survives the night. But that base up there, if it doesn't get raided by the owners, it'll probably get raided by the people that wanted to raid it in the first place. It looks like we have a competing cave here and I'm building blocked, which is kind of annoying. But if we go back here, I think this cave is what's taken. Oh, but it's decaying though. That's good. I don't know if it's a good idea, but we could try raiding it. It's screwed, dude. Let's just try and raid this thing. Why not? Even just with the 2C4 through rockets we got from Heli, you never know how far that'll take us. I don't know if it's going to have like actual loot, but why not? Seems fun. All right, suited up and ready to go. Here goes nothing. Jackhammer, that's kind of good to see. That means they've been farming. Uh, okay. Why is, what is going on with this base? Okay. Thousand scrap. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. Again, bro. Script it. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Guys, I'm sick. I didn't stutter or choke. I'm sick, okay? Trust me. What a come up. Who lets rockets just decay? You never see that. What a worthwhile raid. Interesting. I don't know what's going on with this base. So much stone though, bro. What a come up, for real. Let's go take a better look at that loot room. Metal, comps box is looking great. Boom boxes, bruh. Two C4, two rockets for all of this? That's worth it, jeez. No tier three in here, weird. I was thinking about going through the front and I'm really glad I didn't because uh, that would have been rather expensive. Bro, what a come up though. What a come up for real. That's crazy. This wipe's been going exceptionally well. I don't want to jinx it, but dude, something's going to come along and mess this up. It's gotta. I could just take over this cave. I mean, I'm going to be honest. This is a really uh, poorly built cave and it could be far worse. But I got to remember, man, I have Lucky Llama standards like Lucky Llama builds like 8 billion rocket cave bases. So like this is pretty good for me. And it's it's not though. It, honestly, it's better than the base I'm living in. I, I think also more specifically, it's more hidden. I have a feeling that that tower is going to get raided. I don't know. This cave base might not. 51 hours on the cave. I think I'm going to I think I'm going to take this over. It's probably going to take a few hours, but I'll get this place nice and squeaky clean and stuff and, you know, dust off all the cobwebs that were in here and I think we'll be okay. I'm kind of messing with this. This thing's pretty spacious. I don't know what's going on uh, over here, but I'm digging this. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't. Now I feel so much safer keeping like my loot offline, but we still got to hit that one raid by the sulfur quarry. I still want to do that. Don't think I've forgotten, but I still got to figure out. Well, actually the components thing I'm set. I still got to figure out charcoal, but this actually is a lot. This is quite a bit we've got 10 rockets down here so this is our boom that we're working with we have 10 rockets down here i don't think we have like any boom upstairs realistically i think like 20 rockets 24 rockets is the max for that because it's just a honeycombed two by two so the most it could be is metal she metal and then high qual selling horse poop who am i man who am i dude I who know. am i 
Why would I know? Come on, man. How old are you? I'm 20 years old. 20? Uh, you're maybe, you're probably too young then, maybe. I think Michael I Jackson. Oh, well, I know who fucking Michael Jackson is. <laughs> Smooth, dude, dude, Michael Jackson, the singer, dude. Come on, bro. Yeah, of Smooth course. criminal. I know Michael You've Jackson. You've been hit by You've been struck by a smooth criminal. Thought you said you didn't know. My bad. Well, look, I Honestly, mean, there's no way, dude. Just based on the outfit, I wouldn't know. But if you like started singing a song or something, maybe then I would have gotten it. Yo, hold on a second. Hold on a second. What? I know you. I don't think you know me. I know. I don't think you do. I think you're confused. You're good, man. You're good. Keep it, uh, keep it on the DL, though. Are you selling fertilizer? Do you want fertilizer? Here. I'm trying to, dude. I'm trying to. I'm trying to. Here, take, look below you. Take that. I'm not gonna sell all my- Here, just fucking take all my shit. Nice. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna oh, sell shit, all of it. dude. I'm too lazy. Nice, brother. All nice, right. Nice, brother. Well, uh... Hey. Keep yeah, on being a luck, smooth man. criminal. Thanks, bro. All right. Today has been very productive. If it doesn't end here in part two, I think we're going to try and raid the sulfur quarry. I think that's what we're going to try and do. Uh, I'll probably just do some like base upgrades. I've already done some base upgrades. You probably can't really tell, but you know, the base will be a little different in part two, but yeah, what an insane day of rust. Let me tell you what a great solo run so far. Uh, I look forward to the next part and uh, maybe when I get back, we'll try and raid this sulfur quarry base and that'll be the start of the next video so hey i appreciate you guys you guys are amazing thank you so much for all the love you've been showing on the videos uh consider dropping a sub a lot of you guys aren't subbed i know you know the whole spiel like the video otherwise lucky llama will be in your base all right we don't want that i'll see you in a day or two with the next part assuming i'm not rated or something and if i am rated well there will be an update it'll say in big red text you got rated but what a crazy day today part two coming at you very soon good night everybody B-roll, 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 blur. Fade to black.